Cancel HIV is sponsored by the Prince George's County Health Department. At WUSA 9, we're taking the time each month to bring awareness to HIV. We're sharing the stories of people hoping to educate others about this disease and how to prevent it. One Maryland man has lived with HIV his entire life, but with the help of doctors at Children's National Hospital, he's become undetectable and able to live a normal life. Marcella Robertson has his story. I am 23 and I've been with them since birth. The pediatric HIV program at Children's National Hospital was one of the first in the country. Over the last 30 years, that team has helped many children, like Greg Jones. I didn't understand what HIV was. As the years went on, the doctors started to explain to me exactly what it was and how it, would and how it has been affecting my life up to this point. Greg was born HIV positive. He contracted it from his mother, who died from AIDS when he was just two years old. Decades later, there are less than 50 cases nationwide of children who acquire HIV from their mothers. The United States as a nation is very close to the target of eliminating mother-to-child transmission of HIV. For Greg, that advancement in medicine means a lot. It's also allowed him to go from several medications to just one, and he's now considered undetectable, an accomplishment he credits to both his doctors and his dad. Well, my dad is a single father, and so he definitely played a huge part uh, in making sure that, you know, I took my medicine when I had to take it. And next week, after 23 years, Greg has his last ever appointment with his doctors at Children's National. Lord knows where I would be <laughs> if it wasn't for their care and compassion behind everything that they did. I feel like my story can help a lot of people in certain ways. Marcella Robertson, WUSA 9.